The White Clock There's a white clock that ticks on hurriedly on a blue wall, its light reports not languishing in their cadence, but it only tells one time, ten seconds prior to sixteen after six. The second hand twitches with every pulse, remaining as though nailed in place. Piece of junk, I mutter, from a cloud of thought, eager to precipitate cuss words on an object I bought that will not behave as I want. It's the chain of lightning zapping this cloud from clock face reflection, with a frightening brightness that says, maybe this clock has something to tell that other clocks cannot. There was a bleeding messiah nailed hands outspread to a man-made tree, but he always points to his time. He went about neither lazily nor with impatience, and he tells us to do the same. Sinners such as I are the pieces of junk for whom he lived, suffered, and died. But he rose again, ticking timelessly, living without death, ascending to the cloud of God's glory to precipitate his grace through holy paraclete to his people who understand the times. Let us, then, who've died in him also spread on moving hands to embrace the brightness of eternal noon and tell the world that though we die we live, because those who only race the numbers and circles winding ever to the end of life cannot.